Alrighty, kiddos, what is going on? Uh, it's your girl back here. Oh my god, that is fucking loud. Alright, so. Um, basically what I've got going on here is I did a poll recently on Instagram and Twitter, but no one follows my Twitter, so that's fine. Um, on for you guys to pick my starter. And... We kind of had a little, we had a little problem here. Um, basically, it was a tie between Tepig and Snivy. Um, I was gonna debate on repolling, but at the same time, I didn't want to because that mean I would have to wait like another day or two to stream. So. What I decided on was I looked through the Pokemon that are actually within the region itself to see which one I would have better finding another fire type or another grass type. And essentially it came down to I'm going to be getting another fire type instead of Tepig. Um, and the reason I decided that was just because like I'm really not the biggest fan of firefighting types at all, because there's, there's, as far as starters go, there's too many of them, honestly. Like, you got Blaziken, you got Infernape, and you got, uh, Ambor, and it's just like, there's too many of them. They don't need to all exist, and I really wish, like, half of them didn't. Like, Blaziken, like, I just, Blaziken, Blaziken I don't have problems with, because Gen 3 is my favorite region. But, like, that's that's beside the point. So, anyways, um, so, basically what I'm saying here is that my official starter for this white playthrough is going to be my little Snivy. So, and, with the, the, which kind of sucks, because honestly my favorite starter of this region is Oshawott, and... One of my friends picked Oshawa, but it wasn't enough to actually make it to the tiebreaker. So, and because I know that there are better fire types than grass types in the later game, um, that's why I'm choosing Snivy. So, without further ado, my grass type starter is Snivy. Snivy, however you want to pronounce it. I don't know if sure. And I'm fast forwarding. Just immediately thrown into a battle, why not? Oh, I thought I was gonna read the dialogue shit. That's my bad. Oops. Hello. We're just gonna keep tackling it, there's really no point in doing anything else. <clears throat> and we just destroyed my bedroom. That's fine. But I'm not healed. I call bullshit. I'm not healed. Where am I healed? Did she heal me? I guess she healed me. Woo, critical hit. All right. Oh, come on, really? 
I should take it out. Yeah, boy. Uh, let me do a few things here real quick. Um... That's all I'm going to do. I, I, I keep forgetting to read dialogue. Hang on one second. Um, I'll be waiting in front of the Pokemon Research Lab. Bianca. Oh, wait. I've got to go home first. Thanks for having us over. My, my, Violet. Pokemon battles are so lively, aren't they? I could hear the Pokemon's cries clear down here. Hmm, that sure reminded me of my first Pokemon battle. Oh, and you know, after a battle, you need to rest your Pokemon. See, now I'm rested. The po your Pokemon is looking great. Now, if you're going out, don't forget your cross transceiver. Pain cross transceiver. You're going to thank the professor too, right? Better get going, honey. Yeah, I guess I should. Common courtesy. Oh, look, P Dove. Where'd Bianca go? It's just here. Also, I can't run yet, so that's great. Which one's beyond this now? Is it the best one? That's Jared's one. Overshot, my bad. But I'm, I'm a good trainer who's got a Pokemon and everything. I can totally go on an adventure. Oh, it's okay. It's fine. I'll be waiting for you in front of the lab, okay? Well, I guess that's that. Okay, let's go meet the professor. <clears throat> Hi there, I've been waiting for you, young people. Let me introduce myself then. My name is Professor Juniper. You know your name. Come, come, Sharon. This is not a time to take things lightly. Today is a day to remember always, so it's best to behave with some formality. That being so, once again, my name is Professor Juniper, and I'm researching when and how the creatures called Pokemon came into existence. Oh, that's unusual. You've already had a Pokemon battle, so maybe that's why it feels as though your Pokemon have already begun to trust you. By the way, would you like to give your Pokemon a nickname? Yes. Let's see. Um, actually, I think I might end here right now, just so I can have y'all nickname my Pokemon. Yeah, yeah, I'll, that's what I'll do. Because I'm going to be deciding what my team is throughout this game. So I think the least I could do was, like, is, like, pull, like, a Twitch Place Pokemon type thing. And just let y'all control, like, certain aspects. So I'm going to go ahead and pause and end the video here just for today. Um, so I can have you guys name my Snivy. So, uh, keep in mind it is a male, but that's not really going to stop me from choosing anything. Um, basically, whatever whatever comment is the best or the funniest or whatever is probably going to win. Um, so yeah, just you know, comment away on what uh, name you think my little Snivy, who eventually will be a Servine and a Superior, should have for the rest of the name of this playthrough. Um, and we'll go from there. So thank you all for watching, and I will be back probably in like a couple of days or so with the name. And then we'll go from there. So, without further ado, adios, and I'll see you guys in the next video.